नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम सी यू न्यूज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम टुडे इज नाइनटीन ऑफ अक्टूबर ए बी सी स्टडी इज रियलाइज रेनफॉल्स अंडर द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ डिफरेंट सिनोप्टिक सिस्टम्स लाइक ट्रफ्स एंड ईस्टर्ली वेब यू कैन सी फ्रॉम दिस सेटेलाइट ऑल्सो दैट तमिलनाडु रिपोर्टेड हैवी टू वेरी रेनफॉल ऑफ दर्ड ऑफ सेवेंटीन सेंटीमीटर इन तिरुवन्ना मलाई कालासपक्कम स्टेशन एंड उड़ीसा ऑल्सो रिपोर्टेड स्टडे इंटीरियर उड़ीसा स्पेशली नॉर्थ इंटीरियर उड़ीसा मयूर भंज डिस्ट्रिक्ट रिपोर्टेड फोर्टीन सेंटीमीटर सो दिस इज द सिग्निफिकेंट रेनफॉल अदर देन दैट महाराष्ट्र एंड एडिजनिक एरियाज ऑल्सो रिपोर्टेड सम थंड स्टॉन एक्टिविटी स्टडे ए बी सी टूडे इज नॉप्टिक सिस्टम सो देर इज ए लो प्रेशर एरिया दैट वॉज ए स्टडी नाउ सीन एज ए वेल मार्क लो प्रेशर एरिया इन द मॉर्निंग ओवर ई सेंट्रल एंड एडजोनिंग वेस्ट सेंट्रल एवं सी एंड दिस सिस्टम इज लाइकली टू मूव नॉर्थ नॉर्थ वेस्ट नॉर्थ वेस्ट वार्ड्स अवे फ्रॉम द इंडियन कोस्ट देर फोर द इम्पैक्ट ऑफ दिस सिस्टम इज नॉट सो नॉट सो मच ओवर इंडियन रीजन एंड अनदर इम्पॉर्टेंट सिस्टम इज दैट साइक्लोन सर्कुलेशन दैट इज ओवर टूडे सीन इन मॉर्निंग एट थर्टी आवर साइज टी ओवर साउथ वेस्ट एंड एडजोनिंग वेस्ट सेंट्रल वे बंगाल ऑफ north tamil nadu and south andhra pradesh coast and this system is going to give some uh, heavy to very rainfall today over uh, uh, tamil nadu and adjoining regions and uh, there is an imp- one more important system that is cyclone circulation today seen over central andaman sea and uh, this system is likely to in- intensify into a low pressure area Uh, over east central bay of bengal at jonu north and wansi around 21st of october and thereafter this system is likely to move north westwards and intensify into a depression around 23rd of october accordingly this is most important system imd is regularly monitoring this system and under the influence of this system the rainfall is likely to uh, start from north coastal and pradesh south odisha coast from 23rd and thereafter this system will give heavy to very rainfall over odisha and gangetic west bengal on 24th and 25th so this system is in regular monitoring by imd so accordingly the highlight is that uh, under the influence of uh, uh, different system as mentioned already heavy to very rain for likely over parts of south and india today over andaman nicobar islands on 20 and 21st and over parts of east peninsular coast during 24 to 25th of october so this is the highlights with the highlights let us look at day by day weather warning so this map is showing weather warning for 19th of october you can see that heavy to very rain fall with orange color is given to tamil nadu and followed by yellow color with heavy rain fall over south and karnataka rail sima coastal and pradesh and some active Activity also likely over Maharashtra and Gujarat region today with heavy rainfall possibility and thunderstorm activity. Central parts of the country, especially Madhya Pradesh and Vidarbha, where thunderstorm activity is expected today. And uh, Marathwada, Marathwada, and adjoining regions of Madhya Maharashtra also likely to witness intense thunderstorm today. And uh, as regards east parts of the country, Odisha is going to experience heavy rainfall with thunderstorm activity. And Gangetic West Bengal and North East India likely to experience thunderstorm activity today. And Andaman Nicobar Islands also likely to experience heavy rainfall today. if you see the weather warning for 20th so intensity of the rainfall will, will increase over andaman and nicobar islands with possibility of heavy to very rainfall on 20th of october and heavy rainfall is likely to continue over south and central india especially coastal and pradesh south and central karnataka tamil nadu and kerala Maharashtra and Gujarat especially Konkan Goa Madhya Maharashtra and Gujarat region likely to continue to experience heavy rainfall on 20th of October if we see the weather warning for uh, 21st of October so heavy rainfall uh, intensity will increase over Andaman and Nicobar Islands on 21st heavy to very heavy and heavy rainfall over South and Central India especially Tamil Nadu Kerala and South Central Karnataka and uh, heavy rainfall over North Central Karnataka on 22nd the intensity of rain rainfall is likely with heavy rainfall over kerala south karnataka and also adjoining regions of maharashtra and telangana thunderstorm activity is expected on 23rd the intensity of rainfall uh, will decrease over coastal and pradesh and odisha region with possibility of heavy rainfall over north coastal and north, north coastal and pradesh odisha and gangetic west bengal and heavy rainfall over kerala and south karnataka on 24th of october the intensity of rainfall will de- increase over odisha and gangetic west bengal and also over coastal and pradesh with possibility of heavy very heavy rainfall over odisha and adjoining regions of gangetic west bengal on 24th and heavy rainfall over tamil nadu and kerala on 25th of october the heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over odisha and gangetic west bengal on 25th of october so these are the fisherman bonding graphics you can see that uh, today 
tomorrow and day after tomorrow the main uh, fishery and burning has been issued uh, for uh, andaman sea and adjoining uh, areas of bengal and thereafter uh, uh, also under the influence of uh, today's belmark low pressure area and its further movement uh, northwest wards the different regions of uh, central arabian sea also likely to uh, experience uh, squally weather uh, with possibility of uh, have heavy rainfall over there so accordingly thunder accordingly fishery and burning has been issued uh, for the shared regions in arabian sea and the uh, intensity of uh, wind and uh, rainfall will increase uh, from uh, 23rd of october that is uh, day 5 over central bay of bengal and adjoining regions of uh, uh, south and uh, north bay of bengal you can see and the uh, details are available at rsmc new delhi website also so this is update for today we'll update tomorrow till then namaskar jai hind jai bharat